Hello friends, in this tutorial I will be showing you how I created this reversible one-piece swimsuit. I used a pattern from Design It Sew It. This video is not sponsored, but I wanted to let you know where I did get this pattern from and if you would like the link, let me know in the comments. Let's get started. After cutting out the front and back from the pattern that I purchased, I placed the front outer fabric with the front inner fabric, right sides facing each other. Next, I clipped all the areas that I'm going to take over to my serger to sew. I am sewing all around, only leaving the sides and the crotch open. I will repeat all of these same steps to the outer and inner fabric of the back as well. I took the front and back pieces to the serger and sewed all around, leaving the sides and the gusset or crotch open. I am now creating the straps for the swimsuit. The straps will go inside the front of the swimsuit. If you would like a video on how I create my straps that are more detailed than this little snippet that I'm giving you here, let me know in the comments and I will create that video as well. You can choose to add elastic to make the straps stronger and more professional looking. So the straps that I created, what you see now is me using my loop turner to turn them to the right side. I created two straps that are going to be inserted into the front of the swimsuit. They will tie around the neck. Both of the straps are 20 inches long and one and a half inches wide. Next, I inserted the straps inside of the front of the swimsuit. I pinned the straps down and took the front of the swimsuit over to my regular Singer heavy duty sewing machine. And I stitched across the top, securing the strap to the front of the swimsuit. I also use my loop turner to help me insert the straps inside of the front. And I also used a pin to secure it down prior to sewing. It's 
So that's the areas that I am going to sew. Now that the straps were sewn down off camera, I took them to my sewing machine and I did stitch across. I turned the front of the swimsuit to the right side. So you can see that is the front and this is going to be, like I said, a reversible swimsuit that you can wear on both sides. So it's like you have two swimsuits. It gives you two separate looks. What you see me doing now is I grabbed the back and I am inserting the back of my swimsuit into the front with the same side, same style, I'm sorry, fabric facing each other. So I kind of stuffed it all in there like a burrito, but matching up the sides, um, you know, sides of the front, sides of the back together, the gusset, I aligned it together as well. And I am just making sure that everything is lined up perfectly. I'm putting the straps inside and then I am going to pin all the open areas closed and take it over to my regular sewing machine and I am going to stitch it down with a straight stitch. This may have taken me the most time out of this whole entire project. Um, this swimsuit was fairly easy to create, however, making sure that all four layers of the fabric are aligned was the most tedious part. And it takes some time and experience being able to sew them all through, all four layers, catching all four layers, and making sure that everything lines up while you're sewing is a bit challenging. All right, so now I'm gonna take this over to my sewing machine and I am going to sew those sides together of the front and the back, and I am going to sew the crotch seam or the gusset as well. So here it is, it is all sewn together. I'm just cutting off some of the excess fabric on the sides. All four layers, the front and the back of the swimsuit are all tucked inside there like a burrito. And now I'm going to take my seam ripper and I am going to open up a hole. I'm going to take out a few stitches in the top of the bikini and I am going to use that hole which is going to be, you could do an inch or two inches. Um, I did about an inch and a half. And once I get that hole open, I'm going to pull the entire swimsuit through that hole. And then you can take that open hole over to your regular sewing machine and then just sew a straight stitch across. Or you can hand stitch it closed with like a blind stitch or blanket stitch, whatever it's called. I'm still learning that one myself still trying to perfect that one um, and here we are I'm turning it inside out so exciting and you can see one side is that plaid print so one day I can wear it like that if I took it on vacation I could take one swimsuit and it'll look like I have two and then on the inside is a whole nother look so you can choose to wear it on either side and it is all of the seams are enclosed and it's fully reversible beautiful and here is the end result look how cute that is and it's fully covering and beautiful Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to see more videos like this. The more subscribers I get, the more content like this I will create. Thank you guys for watching. See you in the next one.